Hello and welcome to this tutorial in Anime Studio and today I'm going to show you how to make things rotate like this if you want to make uh, clock hands or propellers on planes or wheels on cars anything that you want uh, to rotate like this stop this here and we'll go to making a new document and the first thing I want to do is turn on the grid so I enable the grid and let's take a look at grid settings yeah that's okay and then I'll zoom in a little bit and then come over here and make a new group and then a bone uh, layer and then drag the bone layer on top of the group and the vector layer on top of the bone layer so it goes first the group then the bone and then the vector and first I'm going to draw a bone so click on the bone layer and come over here to the bone tool and just drag a bone out to about here now you see it snapping to the grid we want to do that and maybe just one more and that the bones in place I'm going to draw a circle and see how it steps into place and then what I want to do is put in one more vector layer let's put in another vector make sure that it's under here and then turn off the uh, circle layer that we just drew and we're going to start drawing a uh, propeller what I want to do is just click on here and just let it snap into place and then draw another one on this size see it's about six right one two three four five six seven okay one two three four five six seven there we go and then turn on the uh, circle layer again and now add some physics to it so go up here to physics and enable that double click the bone layer go to physics and turn on pit to origin and enable motor and it's going to spin at 180 and then uh, let's press play and see what we got okay it's spinning around and notice the blades on this they kind of go outside this maybe we we'll want them to be right here well if we try to drag that it's just going to snap up here to this next uh, grid line so we'll change it a little bit go up here to view grid settings and change this from 20 to I think 10 will be good and you see the grid becomes more fine and then we can come back and select our blades center on the keyboard deselect everything get the translate points tool click on it and just drag it to the next one and then go back here and we have a spinning uh, propeller now you can do this with uh, clock hands you would have one layer for the um, big hand and one layer for little hand and maybe even for seconds and you'd make them spin at different uh, rotations speeds double click this layer again here go to physics change this to about 360 press play and see what we got so it spins faster so this concludes this tutorial on how to make uh, propellers clock hands whatever you want to spin like that and uh hope you enjoyed this tutorial and see you in the next one bye now